Hey guys, back again to give you a nice little update uh, of the package I got today. It is um, a special Monte Cristo number two, which is historically one of the most famous cigars to come out of Cuba. Uh, it's the undisputed king of torpedoes, so it's been called. Uh, created in 1935, it was only rolled by Alonzo Menendez, and it was inside of the largest cigar company in the pre-Castro era, which was Menendez Garcia Ysia. Uh, it's currently manufactured in the new H. Upman factory in Nueva Verdado. Uh, that oversees the production of all the Monte Cristo number no. twos by only the top rollers in a couple of different factories throughout uh, the region. Um, this one is A uh, January Inyo uh, nine, uh, 2019 boxing, perfectly humidified with Bova. Um, so there's your factory seal, hologram, your Habanas label. Um, again, one of my favorites. It's not one I smoke all the time, although I'm not going to lie, I had one yesterday. Probably because I knew I was going to get this box in a day or so. Um, and I only had a few left existing. But it, it, for 278 bucks, I think I paid for this. And, uh, under 12 bucks a cigar. Sorry for the shaking camera there. Um, and it to be so historically uh, phenomenal. I mean, I can't imagine a better torpedo, although I do like the Boulevard El Coso Fino, um, and I like the Partagas. Uh, this box actually has two plastic seals, which I really like. Um, being a year old already, I'm going to be happily enjoying these uh, relatively soon. I don't think a Monte Cristo, even though it does come with a, uh, a little punch to it, um, requires any mellowing whatsoever. And I personally like a stronger cigar, so my preference would be to smoke these relatively young anyhow. Uh, it doesn't mean that flavors won't mature and get more refined in, in, with age. Uh, but here we go. Uh, your certificate of authenticity. And what we've been waiting for gorgeous medium brown perfectly formed oh, the smell of these two could uh could wake you up that's for sure these are amazing but again these are probably my favorite torpedo um not the strongest i think the bellicoso finos from bolivar is my my favorite stronger cigar but this is just a refined uh flavors in this cigar that you just don't get from any others and again it, it's one of the most famous that comes out of the out of cuba and everybody tries to replicate it and you, it's just not possible um, but let me know what you think any questions comments please uh I'm happy to respond um but again two boxes gotta find a home for them in my humidor now and uh let you know when i smoke them thanks